A Franklin County man narrowly escaped shots fired this weekend. The sheriff says two men started fighting inside a BP station off 127 North Friday. The fight spilled into the parking lot. WKYT's Hillary Thornton talked to the clerk inside about the shots fired and about what he did that may have saved the victim's life. She has our top story at 11. The BP station off of 127 just north of Frankfurt is typically a quiet place. Everything's always been the calm country scene out here in Peaks Mill. However, that was not the case Friday evening when two men walked into the store arguing. Pushing, shoving, and contact like that. Clerk Alex Steiger's deciding to step in. As I came out of behind the counter, he took an open Bud Light bottle that he had carried into the store and slung it uh, at the... Uh, other male that he was bickering with. Steigers then remembers out of concern for the safety of his co-workers and other customers immediately stepping in between the two men. Grabbed a hold of uh, the guy that was really starting to the conflict. I told him, man, this ain't the place to be doing this. You need to calm down. Giving the other man enough time to get outside to his vehicle, Steigers thinking the situation was over. At that moment, a lady came running in saying, hey, he's got a gun, he's got a gun and then the gunshots went off outside. Hearing five to six shots fired at the man taking off in his vehicle, thankfully, no one was hit. Now knowing what happened out here in the parking lot and that that man had a gun, the clerk says he would not change how he reacted. Without a doubt, I still would have jumped in, for sure. A decision investigators say after watching the surveillance video kept this situation from being much worse. He uh, told me that as brave as it was and as stupid as it was, um, I saved his life. Well, I, I just view it as doing what any human person should do. It's, uh, it's just the way you should take care of the world. In Franklin County, Hillary Thornton, WKYT. Steigers did give detectives a description of the man and a license plate number. He says investigators told him the fight was potentially related to a heroin bust the sheriff's office made the day before.